So hi everyone. So today I will show you how to do manual listing using the new feature of eBay, the multi-user account access. So so I have a I have a video about this. So for those who are sellers, uh, there I have a video. I created a video about this. So how how you can add your uh, VAs, your virtual assistants, to your uh, eBay store using this multi-user account without uh, giving them access without giving your login details. So this is very uh, this is very good for us sellers because uh, you know we can we can let our VA do their job uh, without any use of software. So, and this is a good uh, features, feature for me, you know, as a seller. So, they don't, I don't need to give my login details anymore for the, to, to my VAs, uh, but they still can do their jobs, uh, listing, research, and, and um, uh, what they call this, and also like fulfillment of orders. So, you have you have uh, you can give access this uh to your vas so but right now <laughs> uh, uh, i will not tackle about the multi-user account so if you want to see how to do this uh, i have a video below uh, i will uh, i have the link of the video uh, in my description box so check it there so right now what i'm going to uh, show you is how to how to list uh, products using this multi-user account access. So this is for VAs. So to to all uh, eBay virtual assistants. So I will teach you how to use uh, this multi-user account. So there is a two option you can do it. So so for exam uh, for the first one you can go to your uh, account name here so uh, again this is uh, this eBay account is the account of you VA you know your account of a virtual assistant so so this is your account so for example you are from Philippines so you you need to create a eBay account uh, eBay.ph so it's it's okay so the your client will give you access and then you will accept it. So if you don't have if you don't have uh, account yet, so what you're going to do uh, for you to have access to the store of your client, you need to create an account on eBay. So if you already have created a eBay account, you will just need to log in and then accept the invitation, and that's it. And then so so again. Uh, how to list using this multi-user account so what you're going to do is go to your account and then click account setting so in account setting so uh, so you will go here per permission and then so you will see here this one is already active so this is uh, for example this is my client so what you're going to do click this small box under action and then go to seller hub and then so you just need to uh, log in and there you go so you already here on the listing on the seller hub so you will see here you, so you only have three uh, categories here because this is the only uh, task that your client wants you to do. So, for example, the orders. If if your your client wants you to fulfill the 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 order, so here, and then listings. So, if you uh, your client wants you to do listing, so it's the active drops ended, and then research. So, if you want to you know to do uh, product research using the therapy. So, okay, so what is the other one? Let's go back again in the eBay. 
And then, what you're going to do, for example, uh, this is my product that I want to list. So copy this, this uh, title. And then, okay, you will go here in the search box. So, that. So you will see here there's already uh, existing uh, products that are already sold in here. So what we're going to do is we're going to use this. So you will see here it already have nine sold. So it means this is a, a good product to list. And then what you're going to do is click sell now. So this is more easier way uh, to list a product. Okay, so it's already here. So what you're going to do is uh, you just need to uh, edit or make it more uh, better, the title. So, for example, I already did that. And then, so the good thing here, you don't need to, uh, to you know, to enter everything here because we are just using the existing listing. Uh, so it's more easier for, for us. Okay, so what we need to do is add photos here. So for example, this one, we're gonna uh, upload this one. Okay. So let's just wait. Okay, so right. So, okay, so we will just add the photo here and that's it so you can add more photos so this is only an example so i will just use one photo and then so item specific so uh you can add you know so for example ankle with this one is this an ankle weight yes so update so is this a gym and training yes and this this is a five pounds no because what we are selling is 2.5 pounds Okay, so for example, this one, so, so we will uh, edit this because what we are selling is 2.5. So always be careful, you know, you should, your title should be uh, the same as your option, a uh, uh, description, okay? And also your uh, picture, so always, okay, always keep on mind in that. Okay, so brand, Gold's Gym. So you see, automatic. You don't need to. You don't need to put everything here. Okay. And then, so item description. So what we're going to do is, we will check the, the description of this item. So here. So what we're going to do is, we will just copy this one. So in we will copy this. So, for example, about this item. So here, about this item. So, you know, you can you can make it more, uh, you know, uh, better or make it more like colorful. This one. So, for example, I want to make this like red, and then I want to make it like a, a bold. So like that, and then. Uh, we're going to do back to Arial and then uh, black. Okay. Hmm. Okay, let me see. Okay, so let's copy uh, this, the description. Okay, wait. Okay. Okay, copy, okay, like that. Okay, so, so this one, we can make it also like red, just to be uniform, aerial black, and then make it 18. And then we can, we can also like make it a little bigger. So like that. Okay, like that. 
Okay, so like that. So after the description, so always check if you have the same, you know, your 2.5 pound pair, so that's okay. And then it should be fixed price, you know, if you're not offering uh, auction. So mostly uh, in, the, in the shipping, we use fixed price, not, not uh, auction. Okay, so buy it now. So the price and then quantity, how much you will put it there. And then always check the payment policy, ship, shipping policy, and return policy. It is correct. And then, uh, let me remove my face here. <laughs> and then list it or save a strap. So that's it. You know, so uh, let's just save this as strap, okay? Okay, so that's it. So that, that's how easy, you know. So this is really a good uh, feature of, of uh, eBay right now that, you know, uh, sellers and VAs uh, can work together using this uh, multi-user account access. So I hope that this video helps you. And if you think that this is a good video, please click the like button, okay? And then if you... Uh, if you're looking for a VA uh, for your eBay store, so uh, don't hesitate, you know, contact me. I have my my uh, uh, social media account there and email address. So I will help you to find a good VA from my students. And if you want to be an uh, eBay virtual assistant or e-commerce virtual assistant, uh, I'm coaching uh uh, VAs and helping them, you know, to to have a good career in this time uh, of, you know, crisis that we have. So if you want to learn more about virtual assistant, uh, please uh, message me or comment here or email me. I have my email in my description box and I will be happy to help you. And if you want to learn more about e-commerce virtual assistant please subscribe to my channel and click the bell button so you can you will be notified every time i have a, uh, i have a new uh, videos about uh, e-commerce virtual assistant so thank you and god bless